Hello everybody, this is Theron. Welcome to Minecraft Land Party. And uh, yeah, this is a little bit of craziness. There's been some work here. Um, I, this is the zombie spawner that I found. And when I first found it, the little zombie inside the cage was a zombie villager. However, it seems to uh, be different now. That, however, is a zombie villager. And send in a minecart and I've got I've got little villagers over here that I have captured and cured with uh, you know weakness potions and magic and golden apples the usual so uh, this situation's a little bit interesting so I've got this guy sitting here I managed to get him into a minecart uh, I'm holding the axe because I find it's actually a more sort of targeted surgical weapon uh, so if you've got like a couple of regular zombies and a zombie villager in here, if you just, if they're all bunched together and you whack one of them with the sword, that area effect, the sweeping attack goes through and like hits all of them and you don't, I don't want that. So uh, the axe will actually let you target a single, a single mob so you can hit one of the zombies and kill just it and not affect the others. So it's a much more targeted thing. This guy now, so I managed to get this guy... Um, into a minecart, but I can't push him onto the track here because he's a jerk. Oh, I, I managed to move him a little bit there. I haven't been able to do that before. Let me eat. So, but I've been, every time I walk up to him, he hits me. Oh, he's, for some reason, acting different now. So, I wanted to do a little bit of Minecraft science here. So I've been trying to, as you see, I've got like 16 emeralds here. I'm trying to figure out. I tried to throw some uh, some stuff at him, some zombie flesh, and uh, and he wouldn't pick it up. Um, I could get a name tag and name tag him, right? But the name tags are 22, and that's a little bit more uh, emeralds than I have. I, I did throw some because I had some chicken eggs. I had to throw some chickens into a, into a little breeder cell here, down into a um, come on, there we go, into a chest. Uh, and I think having problems here now because uh, a my internet sucks, and b I've got like 50 or 60. Uh, chickens down in the pit here and I didn't want to uh, kill them all so here's my thought this guy is a white apron right you can see around his neck there before he turns um, so he's either gonna be a butcher or a leather worker and I don't really care too much if he actually despawns so I wanted to see because again if they're holding something um, or they have a name tag if they basically have an MBT data tag of some sort you will not despawn and huh, I just realized I have a problem here I'll have to fix that um, they won't despawn but I wonder if he's sitting in a minecart if he will despawn and I don't have enough uh, I have weakness potions but I don't have Come on, open up. But I don't have the... Oh, I put those over here. I don't have any more golden apples. And I don't have any gold down here. I have some apples, but I don't have any gold. So I can't make... Hey, what the heck was that? Hi, dude. Oh, this is uh, frustrating. Let the server catch up. Oh. Uh, so anyway, I don't have any I don't have any golden apples Okay, that's really freaking annoying so what I wanted to do is a little experiment Two experiments. So the first one was I was gonna wander away far enough that he would despawn There we go. I've got weakness potions, but I don't have any golden apples. I do you have apples? So I'm gonna go upstairs and then get some more gold and come back and see if he's still here. If he despawns, it's okay. It's not the worst thing in the world. 
I gotta kill these guys. I really gotta kill these guys. Um, and then, if he's still here, I want to try one other thing to see if uh, it would work in future cases. Because then, it would, if I put him into a cell, it would be totally cool. But, uh, so hang on a second. I'm going to kill some chickens. I'm going to go get some gold, and I'll be back. Whoa, hello. Hey, look, I told you this was a slime chunk. All right. Oh, this is going to be good. So I just need to the sweep and attack is nice for the slimes too. Cool. Uh, so yeah, I just need, I think I need to dig this out a bit more and put more platforms in, but that's cool. I just got 17 slime. Okay. So I'm, um, hang on a second, back up to the house and uh, we should be far enough away that if that zombie was going to have despawned, he would have done so by now. But I'll go all the way up just to make sure. Oh, I have to make a better way back over here. All right, so here we are. Back. And he's gone, isn't he? <gasps> he's gone, and so is the minecart. That's no... That's not cool. That's just wrong. That shouldn't be. Oh, I think that's probably a bug. Interesting. Okay. Well, I'm going to have to do some looking on the bug tracker to see if uh, that's something that's been reported. But I, mean, I can understand the zombie uh, despawning. But he should not take my minecart with him. Um, because that's, uh, that's not good. Because that was my minecart. That's, uh, five iron. Ugh. Alright, so, just a quick little demonstration. I've got a little on-off switch here. And then these guys spawn. And they see all the, the villagers over there, so they want to come over. And then I can come in and look and see, oh, hi. And I can actually smack them through the, uh, through the half slabs here and yeah and then go pick up their zombie flesh and experience it's not a bad xp farm as you can see i've got 41 levels i need to go do some enchanting um, but yeah so this is this is a pretty effective little way of getting zombies and zombie villagers here we go hi yeah so if initially while this was a solid wall, I was having to walk in over here because notice they really want the villagers. Um, there's somebody in armor. But no zombies. No villagers. I don't think that guy in the armor is a villager, is he? I don't think so. He might be. But here's what I mean with the uh, the axe. I can hit a single one of them and uh, not kill the others. Now the sword is convenient while there's a bunch of them there, but... The axe is slower, but it's as powerful as the sword. There we go. Hey, dude. Want to come visit? You're just a normal zombie. Okay. There we go. So there we go. And then I can pick up all that zombie flesh. Oh, a whopping six. I got so much. And then I can come over here. And when I get enough... Um, I can come over to the cleric dude here. I have two clerics. This guy has a slightly better zombie flesh trade. Um, and let's see what else. I don't know what a two, one. Yeah, so these his trades aren't going to be great. So I'm going to be wanting to recycle some of these guys out. I don't think there's a way of making them breed down here is the only problem. 
because there's no sky axis, I can't actually make like a village down here. But um, put this back, and then from all those chickens that I killed, there were a bunch of them down there. They're empty now. Uh, so I've got a butcher guy here who has a not great chicken trade, but we can get something out of them and open up. Come on, you can do it. So he'll trade cooked stuff with us. Not too bad, um, but uh, not not the greatest either. So. I have gotten some potatoes from some of these guys, so I'm trying to figure out what makes sense down here. You know, I could I could build a little sugarcane farm for him for paper. Um, I could build a little. Uh, I don't have a farmer at the moment, but I could build a little potato farm to sell to the farmer. <gasps> oh, that's interesting. So wait. So the minecart actually got pushed over here. So they did not steal my minecart, but hmm, that's interesting. So he, he despawned from it, and the minecart moved, got onto the track, and made its way over. I wonder when it did that. Okay, well at least they stole my minecart. Interesting. All right, so anyway, I just wanted to do that little update. Whoops. Oh, hey guys. Um, this isn't, I know this isn't the most efficient way of doing this, but I, I wanna get a librarian with a mending book. And I'd rather do this than travel halfway across the world to get to one of those villages and steal villagers from there. And maybe that's still the better idea, but um, we're going to try and make this work. And again, plus I'm getting all kinds of experience out of it. And it's reasonably close to home. So I need to set up a ender chest so I can have more ready access to some of my stuff. But this is working. And I have a design for this that I'm going to do, and I'll show it to you, but i got to move stuff which is kind of a pain. So right now I've, I've got a bunch of eggs, um, which I will deal with, but uh, we will make a slightly more efficient uh, thing here for collecting raw chicken. Um, only slightly more efficient though. So anyway, that's it. I've got a few guys, Weaponsmith, who has a sharpness, one diamond sword, not not super awesome. Two clerics. I've got a shepherd. I don't have any sheep down here, um, but that might be worth working out. The butcher dude, librarian with um, with sharp one for thirteen, which is not great, uh, but fortune three for sixteen, which actually is good. So I do want to hang on to him. Uh, armor who has a projectile projection too. I'm breaking one diamond chest plate and then the other cleric. So, so anyway, I'm just collecting these guys. The only problem with doing it this way is I'm using up a lot of gold. So um, it's not, not exactly working out, but that's it. So I wanted to show you that and uh, I'm gonna continue working and see if I can make some better progress. And I'm thinking I'll make a second floor for these guys. Uh, when I run out of space here, I can keep digging out. I've got a lot of options, but so that's it. Uh, thank you for watching, and I will see you next time. All right, bye. <laughs>another zombie villager hang on a second okay actually this is a really good uh, example so I've got a zombie villager there got a brown coat so it could be a farmer
which would be convenient. So let me get rid of these other two guys. And what are you doing over there, dude? Yeah, come here. There we go. Hi. Hi. Oh, you are a brown coat. So, so here's here's what I've been doing. Um, let me. I'll take out this half slab here. Ugh. Okay, whatever. I can lose that half slab if needed. And then uh, I've got a few tracks here. Bring it inside. And I have to make a golden apple, so let's go do that. Um, I have gold and apples here, so uh, take a whole block of gold almost. Yeah. This, as I said, this gets expensive. Golden apple. And then go grab uh, weakness potion. And so I can even toss the potion at this guy underneath. Uh, let's see, what's the best way to do this? got the weakness and I can give him the apple hey dude whoa that was super loud sorry about that so he's gonna take a few minutes that is a brown coat right is that purple is this another cleric oh maybe we'll see hang on a sec so I've got this I've got my mine cart get some more tracks and then uh, we'll wait for that guy to convert and we will oops, and we'll be right back these guys don't like walking on rails so I can actually I've actually got them trapped in the corner there I think this is safe wait till he converts hey dude not even paying attention to me. Hi. Okay, anytime now. You're gonna feel better real soon. I gave you like eight ingots of gold to eat. Come on. You can do it. Hello, Mr. Fisherman. Oh, Mr. Fisherman, you're kind of useless, but hey, we'll uh we'll try dealing with you anyway. Mhm. Mm I didn't mean to hurt you. I'm sorry, dude. There you go. Woohoo! Welcome to your new home. So this is uh come down here, let me get rid of these guys. Make sure he's pick up that track, make sure he's pushed in the way, and then uh just sort of do that. Grab my minecart. Hi! Fisherman 18 string. If I had a spider spawner, that would be kinda awesome. Unfortunately, I don't. I don't even have any string down here, do I? No, I don't. Okay, well. But there we go. Huh. So anyway, we can uh, now repair this and get it back up and running and get some more... Get some more uh, zombies. 
I don't know if I even need to keep that fisherman. Maybe we'll, well, I'll go get some string and I don't know how much I have. How much did he want? 18 string, that's a lot. Oh, but he'll take coal. I've got some coal. Let's try it. Let's see what we can do with him. Oh, I don't have enough coal. But there's coal up there. Oh, this is ridiculous. Let me, uh, let me go get that coal. With my fortune three pick. Chicken laying egg there. Okay, just one more piece. Yeah, okay. Cool. So let's see how much we got here. Let's see if the fisherman is selling interesting fishing poles. I don't know if they do that or not, though. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Come on. You can upgrade. Now what he got? Luck of the C1 for eight. Yeah, I don't know about that. Okay. Well, that's that. I let on longer than I expected to. So uh, thanks for watching, and I will. Uh, I'll keep working on this and show you more updates when there's something to update. All right. Thank you, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.